Hello everybody, my name is Zoo and welcome to my channel. Please subscribe for lots of other videos. Today I'm doing a bird watch with me video where I go out to the wildlife reserve where I live and I go shoot some film of some birds that I find and take a few pictures. So let's get to it. So first of all, I wanna talk about what kind of equipment I brought. First, I brought my photography camera, which is Nikon DX3100. The other thing that I brought was my binoculars. These are Tasco binoculars, they're amazing. The last thing I brought was my birdie book, which looks like this. It has a ton of common birds in my area, and it's really useful because I can just find them right there and figure out what they are. I can see a lot of birds. They may all be the same kind though. Normally the elk are here in this big field but I guess that they already left for the winter. But we're gonna go explore some other places and see if we can find some cool birds and maybe some other wildlife. The other duck that I saw very often was the Northern Pintail. And they're really beautiful. They have a white chest and back and then the females look a little bit like mallard females. Birds, it looks like are some kind of duck. Really Amazing birds. I'm definitely scaring them a little bit. It looks like they've got a white neck, and the females look a little bit like the mallard females. The males have a white neck and a white strip on the back. We'll try and find them in the bird book. The first hawk that I saw was a red-tailed hawk. Red-tailed hawks have kind of a brown speckled front and then they have a very distinct red tail. It looks kind of like this. There's the hawk. It is the hawk that I've seen a few times here. It's really big and usually stays and hunts in the lake that's nearby. I did definitely see some blue herons. I think I saw at least three blue herons. They're very common where I live. And then over here to the right, we also have a blue heron out there who's just chilling. There's usually like one or two of blue herons out here as well. So I'm going to try and get a little bit closer so I can take a closer picture. In one of the ponds that I went to, there were a ton of cackling geese or Canada geese. They are everywhere and they are very loud. Another very common bird where I live is the mallard. And I actually didn't know this, but mallards are the duck that every other domesticated duck was bred from. They're the origin of every variety of domestic duck 
except the Muscovy, which is crazy. And I think that's why they're so well known. There's two mallard ducks in the front. And then these geese that look small on camera, but they're quite big in person. And they're super noisy. They're always getting out of the water and then flying around and then coming back again. I'm not really sure what makes them do this. But it's beautiful. I saw one type of predator a lot, and that was the Northern Harrier, Harrier, Harrier. And it looks like this. It has a brown head and a white eye circle thing. And that has a really distinct white stripe across its tail, which is how I know that it's a Northern Harrier. Otherwise, I would have had no idea. Although I did take one close up picture, which I'll show you of the face of one of these guys, so that definitely helped me identify it. I think this is a red-tailed hawk or something like that. I got a few pictures of it, it's absolutely beautiful. But once I look at the pictures a little bit closer, I'll try and identify it. We've seen three herons. I think at least one of them was a blue heron. There might have been actually like an egret or something else. I'll have to look and make sure, see what it is. But we've also seen a hawk. We've seen two hawks. I think one of them's a red red tailed hawk, but I'm also gonna have to look in the book and make sure. I saw some gray ducks with a white bill. I'm bringing my binoculars and I'm bringing this camera. There was another bird that I saw swimming in the water and it took me a while to find it in the bird book, but it's actually an American coot and it has a totally gray body and then a white bill. I'm probably gonna go home soon because it's really cold out here and my fingers are freezing. But I'm just gonna go up a little bit more on the road and see if I can get a closer look at some of those hawks. I love coming here. It's just the most beautiful place to be. Even though it's really cold <laughs> right now. I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here The world seems small We can sit together It's so beautiful You and me meant to be in the great outdoor forever free 